Welcome to our podcast, where we cover unique and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss why an asteroid sample canister is giving NASA a tough time. NASA's Johnson Space Center has been struggling to open a canister, which kept an asteroid sample safe during its journey through space. Pristine samples from an asteroid landed on Earth, enclosed within a tight capsule. However, the curation team for the OSIRIS-REx mission, the first U.S. mission to collect a sample from asteroid Bennu, has been having trouble opening the touch-and-go sample acquisition mechanism head. The team has been handling the TAGSAM head carefully, using a specialized glove box under the nitrogen flow to prevent contamination. In a blog post, NASA said, After multiple attempts at removal, the team discovered that they could not remove two of the 35 fasteners on the TAGSAM head, with the current tools approved for use in the OSIRIS-REx glove box. The team has been developing and implementing new approaches to extract the material inside the head while continuing to keep the sample safe and pristine. On the initial removal of the aluminium lid on the canister, the mission team found black dust and debris on the avionics deck. On 11 October 2023, NASA revealed the first sample collected from Tagsum's outer covering. However, it mentioned that the team still hasn't opened the sample canister. So far, the curation team has removed some of the material from inside the canisters using tweezers. The tools for any proposed solution to extract the remaining material from the head must be able to fit inside the glove box and not compromise the scientific integrity of the collection, and any procedures must be consistent with the clean room standards. NASA wrote in its blog post. According to NASA, the asteroid samples collected exceed the mission's goal of gathering 60 grams of debris from the asteroid. The space agency has recovered 70.3 grams of rocks and dust. The research team has also found an abundance of carbon and water molecules in the samples. The OSIRIS-REx mission, launched in September 2016 and reached asteroid Bennu, in December 2018, the spacecraft landed on Bennu and collected a sample from its surface in October 2020. Then, OSIRIS-REx dropped the asteroid sample in the Utah desert on 24 September 2023. Although the mission has hit a temporary block, the initial findings from the asteroid sample look promising. That's all from this podcast. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments. Stay connected for more exciting discussions and updates in our next podcast.